Hello, I'm Deirdre Hayde, and I am a mystic. And my name is William Arts, and I am the physicist. Welcome to the Mystic and the Physicist. Where science and spirituality meet. The scientific dogma of materialism has become just, it's like a faith now, and the, the scientists are the priests, and they're not looking at the data. When I was a teenager, I started to go, you know, I'm, I'm thinking I'm a little different than other people, but I don't know. <laughs> I was a research laser physicist. What I was doing is I was doing computer modeling for high energy laser systems, and the idea was we'd put these lasers in a 747, fly them up at 70,000 feet, and r melt Russian rockets out of the sky. But as an adult, I've done the research, and I'm like, you know, I think uh, I think not everybody's had these experiences, um, and so now I understand them better. But because we've had science and spirituality, and never the two shall meet. And it's important that they meet. They're both looking at the nature of reality. A mystic is someone who has a camera lens into alternate realities, into other worlds that the normal eye, the normal ears can't see or hear. Really, the idea is looking at mysticism and the other realities and the other dimensions and looking at the facts. The great reality is being connected to all of reality that's physical that we see, and then all of reality that is non-physical that one experiences in the mystical journey. Why a physicist and a mystic? Why, why trot this thing out? Well, I fell in love with Deirdre. She fell in love with me. We got married, and then we realized she's a mystic, I'm a physicist. It's, it's really the, the, the science and spirituality coming together and looking at it in a way it's not contentious, like husband and wife. Absolutely. <laughs> like the physicist and the mystic. <laughs> and cut.